delivery. Oh, hello, Mr. Elf. Lovely day. It certainly is. Hi, Holly. Hi, Ben. Come up. Mr. Elf is kind delivering our food. Yes. Where would we be without elves? No idea, Your Majesty. Cheerio, Mr. Elf. Um, uh... Is there something else? No. Oh, well, yes. I was just wondering if you could pay us today. Pay you? Yes. You haven't paid us any money for ages. Oh, right. How much do we owe you? Um, 492 gold coins. Gosh, that's a lot. Don't worry, Ben. We'll just get some money, won't we, Nanny? Money doesn't grow on trees, Holly. No? No! It grows in the magic money chest. Oh, there's only one coin in it. One coin is all we need. I throw it into the magic money chest. <laughs> it sounds like popcorn. Don't lift the lid up until it stops. It's full of gold coins. Wow, can I have a go? All right, I'll just empty the chest. Now, Ben. Throw the coin in. But I haven't got a coin. You made them all disappear. Oh, without a coin, we can't make money. Um, I've got a button. Perhaps that will work. <laughs> it's doing its popcorn thing. Oh, it's full of buttons. Nanny, can you buy things with buttons? Mr Elf, would it be OK to pay you in buttons? Uh, no. The magic money chest broken? Yes, Your Majesty. For some reason, it's just making buttons. And we need to pay Mr Elf. Don't worry, Holly. I'll sort this out. Ah, this is embarrassing. But the thing is, we're a bit short of money today. No reason to be embarrassed, Your Majesty. No reason at all. Sorry and all that. No, no. Please don't give it another thought. Good. When you get some money, let me know. And I'll bring the food right back. Bye. Oh, bye. I've good news and bad news. What's the bad news? The bad news is there is no good news. Mr Elf's taken breakfast away. And all because we don't have any silly money. What's money for? I'm not really sure, Holly. But the elves seem to like it. Couldn't you fix the magic money chest, Daddy? It's not broken. We just need a gold coin to throw in. Who's got one? That's the problem, dear. Nobody's got one. So how do we get a gold coin? My dad gets paid gold coins for doing his job. Really? Could you do a job, Daddy, and get a gold coin? I suppose I could give it a try. What sort of job will you get, Daddy? I'm not sure. I must be good at lots of things. I'm the king. Ah, wise old elf. I'm looking for a job. <laughs> Very funny, Your Majesty. No, I'm serious. I need to earn a gold coin. I see. Normally, you'd have to go to the Elf Job Centre and answer lots of questions. But in your case... No, no. I command you to treat me like anyone else. Yes, sire. Naim. The king. Mr. King. What was your last job? The king. The king. Any skills? Being king. Mm, we don't have a king job right now. Um, we need a toy factory worker, or a farmer, or a sailor. Ooh, Daddy. Sailor sounds fun. Yes. I like messing about in boats. You will be a sailor on our brand new ship, Your Majesty. It's the king! Hooray! I'm not the king today. I'm just a humble sailor. But we need a king to launch our new ship. Oh, all right then. I'll just be a king for a moment. I declare this ship launched. Hurrah! Now treat me like any new sailor. OK. You can mop the deck. Right. You're doing very well, Daddy. It's rather dull. Why don't I speed things up with some magic? No, Daddy. The elves don't like magic. <sighs> Your job looks fun. Let's swap. Of course, Your Majesty. Much better. Oh, this is fun. Heard a starboard. Which way's starboard? Why can't...
up, they just say left or right. We've hit a rock! Abandon ship! Hello, Your Majesty. How's everything going? Very well. But that ship wasn't strong enough. Have you got another one? Maybe you're not cut out to be a sailor, Your Majesty. What other jobs did the elf lady say I could do? The toy factory, Daddy. That would be fun. It's the king! Hooray! I'm not the king today. I'm just a humble factory worker like you lot. But we need a king to inspect the toys. OK, I'll be king for a second. <coughs> it's perfect. Right, now I'm just a humble factory worker again. What do I do? Press this button and out comes the gloop. <laughs> what about something a bit more interesting? Making the toys? Uh, no, Your Majesty. The painting? Perhaps not. The packing? No. Today you are the gloop elf. <laughs> Very good, Daddy. I think I'm really getting the hang of this. What? Go faster! All right! How are you getting on, Your Majesty? Oh! Perhaps you're not suited to factory work, Your Majesty. What was the last job on the list? Working on the farm, Daddy. The King has arrived to start our harvest dance! Hooray! I'm not the King today. I'm here to do farm work. But it's our holiday. Not when there's work to be done. You heard the king. Back to work. <gasps> Righto, what do I do? This pumpkin needs watering, so it'll grow nice and big. It's not growing. It takes a long time, King Thistle. Weeks and weeks. Hmm. Let's speed it up with a little magic. No, Daddy. That'll help it grow. Wow! That's a big pumpkin. It's still growing! It's not going to stop! Ah! The pumpkin's going to explode! Right. Well, that's as good a time as any to finish my day's work. How many gold coins have I earned? For being a sailor, you earned one gold coin. But for sinking the ship, we'll have to take it back. For working in the factory, you earned one gold coin. But for causing a duck flood, we'll have to take it back. And for working on the farm, you earned one gold coin. But for making the pumpkin explode, we'll have to take it back. But I need a gold coin. I suppose I'll just have to come back to work tomorrow. Ah! Take the gold coin and don't come back tomorrow. One gold coin. I earned it all myself. Oh, well done, darling. We just chuck it in the magic money chest. It's doing the popcorn thing. It's full of gold coins. <laughs> We're rich again. Hooray! Well done, Daddy. You worked so hard today. It was fun. Well, I'm off. Don't want to be late. Where are you going, Daddy? Back to work. I've decided to work evenings. But we have the money, Daddy. There's more to work than money, Holly. The elves need me. Your Majesty, we need you. You see? We want you to be the king again. But kings don't work. I want to be useful. But kings are useful. We needed a king to launch the elf ship. That's true. You launched the elf ship, Daddy. Even though you sort of sank it as well. We couldn't make our toys if a king didn't inspect them. And most importantly, a king has to start our harvest dance. I see. Well, in that case, start the harvest dance. Hooray! Uh-oh. Maybe I am quite good at being king. I think it's the job you're second best at. Really? And what job am I best at? Being Daddy. Ha-ha-ha! <laughs> ah, Daisy! Bobby! Stop making that awful noise! Dang, dang. 
<laughs> oh, this is too loud. Daisy, Poppy, I'm taking your wands away and putting them in the cupboard. <laughs> Mummy is right. No more wands until you learn to use them properly. Ah, oh, finally, a bit of peace and quiet. Oh, who's that? Ahem. Granny Thistle is here. Oh, no! My mother! Granny Thistle! Granny! Granny! Granny. Darlings, darlings, darlings! Marvellous to see you! Holly, give your granny a hug! <laughs> Hello, Granny Thistle! Oh, young Ben Elf, always a pleasure to see you! What's wrong with the twins? Why are you so sad? Wandy, Wandy. <gasps> Where are your wands? I've taken them away for now. But how will they do magic without wands? Uh, maybe it's better if Daisy and Poppy don't do magic. Well, they're your children, darling, and the last thing I want to do is interfere. At least Holly has a wand. <laughs> Oh, yes. Holly's having magic lessons from me. What have you learned, Holly? I can turn people into frogs. Or rabbits. Frogs? You're still on frogs? And rabbits. But that's baby magic. What about the hard stuff, like putting pink spots in the sky? <laughs> or making the trees sing? La, 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 la. No, thank you, Mother. We don't have much need for singing trees. La, la. Or pink spots in the sky. OK, you're the boss. Anyway, I've brought presents. Presents for the children. Presents! Holly, I've brought you this beautiful ring. Thank you. Is it magical? Um, maybe a little. Just don't rub it, OK? OK. And for Daisy and Poppy... Two grown-up wands! Wandy! Wandy! But we've just taken their wands away. Yes, it's lucky I came when I did. These wands belonged to your great-grandparents. Vlad the Powerful and Sharon the Totally Insane. Not dangerous, are they? Only as dangerous as the person who waves them. <laughs> <laughs> right, I think we'd better put these straight in the cupboard. Oh, well, of course, you know best. And it's past your bedtime. Mm. Come on, up to bed. Now for your bedtime story. Little Bunny Bunting. Darling, would you mind awfully if I read the twins the story? Uh, oh, yes, of course. How kind. But uh, try not to get them too excited. They're meant to be going to sleep. Of course. Leave it to me. Once upon a time, there lived a rabbit called Little Bunny Bunting. Sounds a bit boring to me. <laughs> this is the book that I had when I was a little girl. Crazy spells for the under fives. <laughs> Spell number one, how to make a storm. Ooh. What a day. Where's Granny now? Uh, she's with the twins. Oh, is that such a good idea? After me, wave your wands. <laughs> Wandy. No wands? Oh, of course. Mummy and Daddy knew best and took your wands away. Never mind. Here's mine. Wandy. Say, thunder, thunder, thunder. Thunder, thunder, thunder. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> if that had something to do with Granny. Hello. Is Holly coming out to play? Hello, Ben. She'll be down in a minute. Did you hear the storm last night? Hear it? It was in our bedroom. A storm in a bedroom? Cool. It was a magical storm. Good morning, Mother. 
I already know the answer to this, but who showed them how to make a magical storm? Me. What a surprise. Only a little indoor weather, darling. Nothing to worry about. What else did you teach them? Oh, just a few harmless little spells. Hi, everyone. Hello, Holly. Morning, Ben. Ah, why are there two Hollies? Daisy and Poppy did a spell on me. We asked them not to, but they did it anyway. This is what happens when Daisy and Poppy do magic. So, it's a little doubling spell. No harm done. It's not like there's ten Hollies. Morning. 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 And if there were, wouldn't that be nice? Wandy, Wandy. Where did they get the wand from? Oh, it seems to be my wand. <laughs> bye bye. They've disappeared. The twins have escaped. <laughs> <laughs> They're out in the wild. Sound the Daisy and Poppy alarm. <laughs> Oh, this is all a big fuss over nothing. Oh, yes! The twins are out there somewhere and they've got your wand. What other spells did you teach them? Ah, uh, I did mention something about walking trees. Tree go walkies! Walkies! Trees are walking towards the little castle. I don't want to hear it. It's like a bad dream. I suppose this is your doing, Nanny Plum. No, it was Granny Thistle. Hello there. Granny Thistle, I might have known. It's been a long time, Cedric. Not long enough, Millicent. You always were a troublemaker. Yes, Mother. You started this. Now you have to sort it out. OK, you're the boss. I just think children should have a bit of fun, that's all. There's good fun and bad fun. This is bad fun. <laughs> My goodness. Daisy and Poppy, you're a long way from home. Bunny Rabbit! <laughs> <laughs> Froggy! <laughs> ah! Daisy and Poppy are going bananas! <laughs> bananas! I'm a banana! <laughs> <laughs> oh, darlings! There you are! I see you've been doing lots of fab magic. Chicken! Quack, quack! What? Oh, wonderful! <laughs> Hedgehog! Oh, I'm a hedgehog. Groovy. <laughs> Pebble. You've turned me to stone. Maybe not so good. <laughs> Holly, I think it's time for you to rub that ring now. What's she saying? The ring? Rub the ring? I think she's saying rub the ring. But didn't you say not to rub the ring? I've changed my mind. It's not good fun anymore. Rub the ring. All right, here we go. Huh? What happened? We're back in the little castle. And everything's back to normal. No walking trees or spots in the sky. Yes, Holly rubbed the magic ring. It turned everything back as it was. That is some powerful ring. Yes, the ring belonged to your great-grandfather, Neville the Naughty. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at the little darlings. They're all tired out. Story! Story! You'd like a story? Of course, my darlings. Dangerous magic for toddlers. How long is my mother staying for? Two weeks. Chapter One, How to Turn Mice into Dragons. <laughs> dragon! Dragon! <laughs> Aha! Nothing quite like sailing the high seas, eh, Nanny Plum? No, there's nothing quite as boring. Ha-ha, <laughs> my little cherry blossom. 
I love it that you say what you mean. I don't like sailing in boats. They sink. Not my boat. It's unsinkable. Oops. What was that noise? I think we hit a rock. Ah! The boat is sinking. Never fear, Nanny Plum. I know just the people to call. Who's he calling? He's calling Elf Rescue. Elf Rescue? Elf Rescue? Hello! Redbeard here. My boat is sinking. I see you, Redbeard. Hang on. Elf Rescue are go. Calling all units to the lake. Redbeard's boat is sinking. Elf Rocket, A-OK. -okay. Elf Plane, A-OK. -okay. Elf Helicopter, A-OK. -okay. Elf Submarine, A-OK. Elf Rescue Argo. We'll have you out of there in a jiffy. Mr. Elf, lower the claw. Lowering claw. <laughs> Hold on, I'm lifting you up. Hooray! Gosh, that was amazing. Would you like a cup of tea? Yes, please. Biscuit? Ooh, ginger snaps. My favourite. Thank you so much. Think nothing of it, Nanny Plum. It's all in a day's work for Elf Rescue. <laughs> Thank you, Elf Rescue. Not at all. Whenever you need us, just call. Well, I'd better start fixing me boat. And we'd better go home. Oh, I'm too tired to walk. Shall we fly? That's even more tiring. It's not that far, Nanny Plum. I'd feel better about it if I had a biscuit. Maybe I'll call Elf Rescue. But, Nanny, I don't think Elf Rescue is really for giving people lifts home. Nonsense. The wise old elf said, whenever you need us, just call. Elf Rescue? Hello, Nanny Plum here. I'm stuck by the lake. Stuck, you say? Hang on, we'll be right there. Elf Rescue are go. What seems to be the problem? My legs are tired. Can I have a lift home? What? Nanny Plum, the Elf Rescue Service is for emergencies only. Keep your hair on. Can you give me a lift or not? Mm, this is the way to travel. Tea, biscuits and a great view. Dad, can I have a go at flying? No, Ben. You're not a grown-up. It's not Grown-ups have all the fun. We want to rescue people. You're just going to have to wait till you're older. Aww. Thank you, Elf Rescue. And don't waste our time again. Charming. The wise old elf is right, Nanny Plum. Elf Rescue is only for emergencies. Oh, whatever. Cool! You got rescued by Elf Rescue. I wish we could rescue people too. Yes! yes. It's just the silly grown-ups won't let us. <sighs> elf Rescue? Ah, oh, thank goodness. We need your help, Elf Rescue. What's the problem? A big cow is stuck in some brambles. Mm. 
will be right there. Calling all units. Cow stuck in brambles. Hey, okay. Lower the mole. Lowering mole. Launch mole. Launching mole. <laughs> Good. The mole can dig up the brambles. Don't worry, Mrs. Cow. We'll have you out of there in no time. Dum, la -dee dum. Ah! Elf rescue. Help! Help me, elf rescue! Nanny Palum, I told you, elf rescue is for emergencies. This is an emergency. I'm stuck. Stuck with what? A tricky jigsaw? No! In the mud! Oh, Mr. Elf, you take over the cow rescue. I'll deal with Nanny Plum. right all. I can't believe I got stuck in mud. What a day! Never mind. Elf Rescue will be here in a minute, and then it'll be tea and biscuits on the ride home. So? You are stuck. Of course I'm stuck. What did you think? Can't you use magic to get yourself out? No, my wand's over there. I see. Where are Elf Rescue? Are there any biscuits left? We don't need a rocket to pull you out of a puddle, Nanny Plum. It's not a puddle. It's very deep mud. Yes, yes, yes. I'll just pull you out. Oh, it's very deep mud. Told you. No problem. I'll call Elf Rescue. Hello. Thank you for calling Elf Rescue. We're a bit busy right now. Please call back later. Are they coming? No. So what do we do now? Uh, shout for help. Help! 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 Listen! Someone's shouting for help. Help! 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 They need rescuing! We can rescue them! We can be Children Rescue! Hooray! Children Rescue are go! Go, go, go! Ben, Holly! We're Children Rescue! Thank goodness you're here! Are you stuck? Yes! Launch Gaston! To throw this lasso around your waist. Keep still! OK. Lift, Gaston! Lift! Arr. Woo! Hooray! What about me? Oh, no! We won't get to the wise old elf in time. I know. I can magic him out of the mud. Oh, yes. Good idea, Holly. No, no, no. No magic. I want to be rescued properly. That is properly. Magic is cheating. Please let me use magic or we won't be able to get you out. No magic. Please. No, 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 no. Magic, please. Children Rescue! Hello! You rang us, wise old elf. What seems to be the trouble? Ah, uh, nothing. Panic over. Wise old elf, you should know better than to call out Elf Rescue for no reason. But, but... It wasn't for no reason. Children Rescue had to rescue us from the mud. Oh! In that case, I think everyone deserves a lift home. Oh, goody. Biscuits. Oh, this is the way to travel. Got any more of those ginger snaps? Yes, biscuits are go! Go, go, go! <laughs> <laughs>